What's up guys, the Yes McGann here, and today we are playing Nike in the solo lane with her newest skin, which turns her into a well a superhero, I guess. That's that's the that was the goal with the skin. I enjoyed, I think it's pretty good. We are against a Bologna, it looks like, so not going to be the most fun of lanes, but we can uh we can go through the we can get through this lane probably. Nike has decent clear. You go with the mark of the vanguard and it's uh it's the spicy clear, the spicy clear. And the survivability, of course. So, we just have to be careful at this point in the game. And I'm gonna go, let's see, let's go four. Let's go four, three here. And see if we can just survive through this early game, because... If we can do that, we can create a massive, uh... Or be a massive issue for the enemy team, as we are going to be a really, really tanky target. And really difficult to take down with our ultimate and everything, as well as our... One does provide some great utility and are passive. We just have to not fall behind too hard. Not too hard. I would go blue stone because blue stone is decent into Bologna because you can she can't cancel your clear, but I think Mark of the Vanguard is just really good on Nike and all the times I've used it, I've just enjoyed it a lot over the blue stone, which gives you better clear, but it's a lot more a lot more dangerous, I'd say. It looks like this Bologna is starting at a buff or something here. Which is okay with me because I wanted the early advantage in this lane when I could get it. Alright, she get her... Yeah, she got her mana buff minis. I can go to the speed buff though. There we go. Oh. Okay. Bologna? Interesting. Let's go, oh. <laughs> nope, no way we're gonna be canceling that right here. No way that's happening. I think they're going for the speed buff here. Actually, is that only one person going for the speed buff? Alright, okay. Red Toss was going for the speed buff. I think Bologna is now going for her mana buff with her jungler. That's what it looks like. Because her jungler did make a... A rotation. Yeah. No, she didn't actually. She just went for the fire elementals. Alright. I probably should have put another level into my... Or put a level into my two, but... I decided... I mean, it's not the worst... We're not in the worst situation right here. And actually... Ooh. Ray is level 2. Let's see if we can get the Freya here. Oh my gosh, she's so low. Okay, I can't get her. I can't get her. Oh no. That was, uh... Yeah, I don't know what... Rod Tosker uh, thought he was gonna do there, but... He just went- I thought he was gonna stun, at least. I thought he was just gonna stun Bologna, but he didn't, so he died. Which is <laughs> too bad. Nothing much to be- nothing much to be said about that. Uh, except he made a bit of a misplay, but, you know, we'll still be fine in this lane. Freya got the kill, I believe, anyway. Yeah. I didn't even realize Bologna didn't have teleport until just now. She actually went for the Sunder. Which, I don't know, did she not think she was going to lane against Nike? Because it's not the easiest thing in the world to Sunder kill a Nike. There we go. Alright, I'm going to go back to base now. Actually, no, no, no. I'll wait one more wave so I can... Well, actually, no, I can just go back to base here. She doesn't have teleport, so... I'll be fine just selling this and going for my boots. There we go. Have the ultimate online as well. Might be able to force out her ultimate here. Yeah, there it is. I actually would have been able to kill her. I think I missed my last one right there. Actually, I probably wouldn't have been able to kill her still, but she would have been lower. Okay. Oh my gosh, she's so low. Oh. The juke. Probably should have just paid attention whenever she, uh, 
whenever she was moving because I kind of just wasn't looking <laughs> and, I, and I just leaped instantly but that's fine she doesn't have teleport like I said so oh we got Freya over here once again oh we're gonna die to Bologna Actually, they're going to be able to get a kill over here. Enemy ultimate down. Okay. Ultimate is down. Be careful left. All right, let's see if Rod Tosser's got this. Okay, yeah, he's got it. Oh, he's dead, though. He died to Rod Tosser, unfortunately. Or not to Rod Tosser, to the soul. Or Freya. Or, yeah, Freya. <laughs> I have to just cycle through all the names until I find the right one. Okay, I'm going to go for my mana buff now. Unless Freya's there. I doubt she'll be there, though. Be careful, middle. Unfortunate that we died to the Freya. But... Actually, I guess we died to the Valona, but unfortunate that we died whenever the Freya rotated in. We will have a bit of a better... Initiation this game, though, with the Rod Tosker. In comparison to the Freya, but, I mean, Freya's late game is still Freya late game, so we still need to worry about that. I'm pretty sure she just went for her Fire Elementals. Or, yeah, she just went for the Fire Elementals. Okay, she's actually not going Mark of the Vanguard. She's just going straight into Mystical Mail. Which I didn't actually expect here. I thought she'd want Mark of the Vanguard and then Mystical Mail, but because of that, we should have a bit of extra damage on her here. Alright, I'm going to go for another level into the second ability here. Okay, she put a ward down in our jungle. I think Rad Tosker is dead here. Actually, maybe not. Oh, she's actually the Fire Elementals now. Okay. Ah, she was already able to pick him up, unfortunately. And we got Frey over here. Got the Sunder. I think she's going to ult us. Actually, no, she didn't even need to with the speed buff. That's unfortunate. She's going to be able to get us, but we'll still be fine over here. They were able to get two on the right side. And I guess I could just go for the breastplate here. Yeah, we'll just go breastplate here. I'm pretty sure Bologna just went back to base here, but actually, no, she's still here. Okay. Both of our ultimates are down as well. Uh, he's just going to go for the clear here. Rat wants to go in here. We could definitely dive this. Oh my gosh, he missed. Oh my gosh, he missed. Actually, I have my ultimate available here. There we go, we got her. It's unfortunate that Rod Tosker missed, but we were still able to get the kill in the end, at least. We'll go back to base. Alright. We'll leap out of the base and make our way up to the lane, which is going to be really good for us because... Actually, ooh, Scylla rotated over and <laughs> she lost the tower in mid and didn't get any... And she's dead! And she's dead. Awesome.
That was insane! This skin has some interesting voice lines. In all honesty though, I'm not a- I don't actually dislike this skin. It'll probably be the one I use most of the time. I think a lot of people weren't a huge fan of this skin, but it's only 400 gems, so... And I like superhero themed things, so... I'll take it. I'll definitely take it. Ooh, she just warded over here. Actually, I can... Oh man, rat. Oh, you can kill Ganesh here. Yeah, there it is. I think he's probably dead. Yeah. That's Freya's ultimate. Oh, they're still up. Ow. No, I'm gonna go down. That's unfortunate. They should be able to get the Gold Fury here. I don't know. It might have been a bit too late. Still is still in the mid lane, but we'll see. They can't do it really quickly with Soul here. Oh my gosh, no. Ganesh wasn't tanking. <laughs> it reset. Okay, it looks like they still got it though. The enemy team's not even checking. Nice. That's gonna be really good for us. Getting that gold fury after that. Pretty much full rotation from the enemy team to our lane. Or our side of the jungle. The only person who didn't rotate was their their hunter who was stuck under the tower, so. We shall see. And Rat Tosker is fighting Bologna here. Honestly, Bologna should be losing this trade. She doesn't have Mystical Mail yet. Doesn't have Sunder. All she has is the Ninja Tabian Death Toll. And Rat Tosker has his Acorn and Jotun's Wrath because he's really far ahead. Even though it's kind of weird. Everyone in this game seems to be really far ahead. Oh no, he's dead. Oh wait, nope, there's his ultimate. In the middle lane. This is Bologna. Okay, there she is. In the middle lane. Okay. All right, we'll clue that out. I do have a sentry to put around that uh, portal demon. She's really just looking to go back to base to get her mystical mail right here. All right. See if we can keep her around here because we do have the Freya at pretty low HP here. It looks like Soul's in some trouble as well, though. Okay, that should be a dead Bologna. Yeah, there's a Nike ultimate as well. Oh, Soul! I believe in Soul. Ooh, the Aegis. Oh, she missed. Oh, I couldn't get away. That's unfortunate. Unlucky Soul missed her too, but... We were probably a bit too deep anyway. Actually, I don't know. Soul was pretty low. We probably could have taken that if Soul wouldn't have missed, but... You can't win them all. You can't win them all. Let's see. We'll go for the Wing Blade, I think. Actually, we could go... Could go Runic... Runic Shield, which would be pretty good here. Yeah, actually, just go with Runic Shield. Alright, I gotta teleport in so I can get this mana buff, though. Maybe. Nope, not even gonna be able to get it in time. Sadness. Oh, my one. Just... I think I did that earlier, too. It accidentally... I accidentally cancelled it out. Oh, she has the Mystical Mail now. Okay, but we do have the Runic Shield coming soon, which is going to give us a bit more damage. As well as some Magical Protections, which is not only going to help against Freya, but also Bologna's Mystical Mail. Another camera, just for, the bad guys. Lane. Mm. Another camera just for the bad guys. There we go, we'll clear that out. And I think I'm just going to rotate mid here. Let's see if we can get in here quick enough. Ooh, Freya did get a nice banish, but I do have the ability just to... Oh.
Okay, got Ganesh. Oh, who has Enfeebling? Oh, nice. That's two kills. I couldn't get on Scylla, though. Should be able to get Bologna here, though. Ooh, she was able to get Rat. Oh, that's so much damage on Scylla. Man, Soul just does so much damage. Oh, we got Scylla. She decided to stay around a bit too long. We can go for the Portal Demon here as well. Get a level into our ultimate once again. And let's see. We'll just leap over here. I think they, the team just needs me to burst it down here instead of zone. So it looks like we've got this. Yeah, we've got it. Portal Demon going down once again. I'll go for another wave. And then I will go back to base and use the portal to get to the lane. As quickly as possible. Alright. Oh, Freya's not gonna just let us back for free here. Your middle tower is under attack. Not to waste another second. Okay. Well, we've got the Runic Shield online. We have Thorns online. And I guess we can go Wing Blade too. Go through the portal here. And get back to the lane that Freya is in to make sure she doesn't... Or not Freya, Bologna. Freya was here to make sure she doesn't do too much. Ooh, nice. We might be able to force the ultimate here. I don't know if I want to use... Oh, there's her ultimate. Oh. Okay. He didn't want to keep going. Okay, now he does. There we go. I used the ultimate a bit early because I thought he wanted just to dive immediately, but we're going to be able to get her still, and Freya's going to show up, unfortunately, so we can't just... Actually, should be able to get the kill here. Yep, there it is. <laughs> nice job from Rod Tosker. Still is all the way on the right side, so we should be able to get this tower here. There it is. In fact, we could go for another tower here if we want to. I think we could. Let's see, the Bologna, Bologna does have, or does not have teleport. She went Aegis instead, which is kind of interesting. I don't know. I don't, I'm not. I'm not quite sold on that Aegis buy. I would think Thorns would be her option here, or the better option. Because I don't actually know. I forgot that she actually used the Aegis under the tower, but I don't exactly know why. She would get it for our team. There we go. We got Scylla here. Good job from the team. We could take the purple buff and the tower here. Alright, we have all the ultimates ready. Oh, nice knockup right there. I thought he was actually going to miss. Oh, unfortunately, I was silenced. Oh, we should be dead here, though. Looks like we have the tower, though. Actually, maybe not. Oh, no, I'm dead. <laughs> Ganesh got me with the three. Okay, but they're going to lose Ganesh in the process. And if Freya stays around too long, she may die as well. She does have the ultimate. Yeah, there's her ultimate. Ganesh. Holding off the Bologna. Oh man, Soul is doing some damage. Oh, <laughs> and she walked straight through Ganesh's ultimate and got the protection reduction and died to to the to the Neath unravel and ooh, big Soul ultimate. Soul is gonna be able to Aegis it, but Ganesh is gonna take some damage. His meditation is gonna go off though. We're gonna go Wing Blade. Let's see, Wing Blade and they apparently just killed Scylla when I was in the shop. Nice. The team's carrying. The team is carrying. I kind of want to go... I don't want to go for more magical protection, and I want to go Borka Hope. So I'm going to go Borka Hope, and then probably pick up, as my last item, maybe Mid Guardian Mail or something. 
something that would help against the physical damage from Bologna and, and Kurtinos, but also help reduce the damage from Freya. And I think Megardian Mail would be really good. I actually think Megardian Mail may be really good into Kurtinos just in general as well, so. Overall, I think it's going to be a nice pickup. We're going to put a ward on... Actually, does he have a sentry? He has a normal ward. I'm going to place it right there. I think we should wait for a sentry to be put down right there, because I can just go back to base really quick and get one. And man, Soul is just... 1v2ing right there. They did get the tower, though, but still, the 1v2 is quite crazy. Oh, actually, shut down from Freya. Freya's gonna show up. That's gonna be one from Nike, though. I mean, Neath. I am Nike, obviously. Scylla's here. I was actually not expecting that. And that's going to be the surrender. Okay. <laughs> they all stayed and attacked me on the left side. And I was just too tanky for them to take down. And my team was destroying the right side. So they surrendered. Not bad. Even after a really slow and honestly not too great early game. It actually didn't end up too poorly for us. We ended up winning that game quite handily. Because, well, Soul got fed. Rod Tosker got fed. And the dual lane got fed. I actually don't know how Rod Tosker got fed. I guess it was just from farming. Because he was his scoreline was worse than Freya's, but he was a level ahead or tied the entire game, which is pretty funny. Yeah, but not a bad game from us. I quit when I see Bologna and still lose to a Nike. I don't think that was the main reason why he probably probably quit, but yeah, their Scylla was really far behind. Also going Cronus Pendant. In the last video, didn't the Scylla go Cronus Pendant first? Wasn't that a thing? I'm pretty sure that's what someone did in our last video. The Clash gameplay, which is funny because that's actually the the game right before I displayed because uh, I had my finals and everything so I got to record all my videos at the same time pretty much but Still not a bad game from us even after the early game that was kind of rough because we kind of got Kind of got camped by the Freya and the and the Bologna had already had a good matchup So we should have been a bit more careful in the lane We, we let Freya get a few few rotations and kills on us that we shouldn't have and Rod Tosker had an, two unfortunate ganks, which didn't end up too well for us, even though we ended up getting a kill in one of them, which overall wasn't bad for me, but... The good thing about Nike is that after the the early laning phase, mid-game becomes really, really good for Nike, because she does do a decent amount of damage, as well as having the nice passive, as well as the nice effects from her one, and her ultimate making her incredibly tanky and difficult to deal with, so... Really good god in the mid-game stages. Late game, I honestly feel like she falls off a little bit. Just her- I feel like she doesn't do- really do too much damage late game, and her- Her early game- or her auras and passive- or not her aura- or her effect on her one as well as her passive are nice, but... It's just- I don't know, I feel like she falls off a little bit. She does have a lot of control and can be a really strong frontliner, though, in the late game, so... We still would have been strong later on as well, but I think their team- Although they didn't have as great of an initiation as us, they should have still been really strong late game. I mean, they still have Bologna's ultimate, which a lot of times you don't want it to be the initial uh, initiation because it's it's kind of a small radius and you're really only going to catch one person unless for some reason they're all grouped in one spot, which doesn't usually happen until the middle of a team fight. So, but I mean, they still could have done it. They had a Freya, they had a Kernanos, they had a Scylla, so late game could have still been pretty good, but... I don't know, our team just got ahead early. The soul was really strong, which I honestly like soul a lot. I think she her two and her ultimate just do so much damage that it just doesn't even make sense sometimes. And also Neath got ahead, which, you know, you, you want to get ahead with Neath. And if she gets ahead, her abilities can do a lot of damage. Along, of course, with being a hunter, her basic attacks. And like I said earlier, Rod Tosker got ahead somehow. I think it must have just been in the pairing with Soul. Him and Soul just must have done a lot with the doing a lot on the duo lane. And he just had a few just miss mishaps in the soul lane, which didn't really amount to much as Bologna didn't really take advantage of it and went for a build that was kind of awkward not going for the mark of the vanguard into the mystical mill but just going into the mystical mill which overall isn't as good but anyway guys this has been Nike in the soul lane with her new skin which like I said in the video I kind of like you know it's 400 gems it, it's not a perfect skin but I enjoy some parts about it and yeah so please like comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time peace out